the national disaster management authority the un organizations and the local health and education institutions have organized a five day event to sensitize public about the plight of women and children who form the core vulnerable group in post disaster situations we believe that uh, the needs of children and women are different their nutrition needs are different their health needs are different they need different treatment in a number of other uh, areas like livelihood just by mainstreaming the gender issue post disaster situations can be managed better and that too in a better way we don't want to develop a policy at the federal level in the in the drawing room with few discussion we want to know their demands and needs from the grassroots level that is from the district level the ndma's gender cell is drafting a policy framework for the group that faces double brunt of disasters due to its vulnerability The draft policy has created special incentive by adding provision of giving constructed houses to female heads of families. Incentives have been given to elderly and younger population. Every activity that we propose in the disaster management framework, mechanism, and action plan has to uh, provide for the access to all the services that they need in special circumstances, and I'm sure they will be guaranteed. The policy framework decisions regarding shelter and disaster management decisions have been taken on the behalf of government of Pakistan. These sovereign provinces can play a part in providing safer places to women and children. This will also create bankable collaterals in their hands which will ensure social security. With cameraman Suhail Malik, Fatima Mansoor, STTV, Islamabad.